Welcome to another New York City vlog. Today, I realized I crossed over $100,000 in student loan debt. And we're going to be heading into my second year of YouTube pretty soon. And I just thought like when I quit my job, I'd start making YouTube videos and I would just be monetized right away. And that just has not been the case. Nothing wrong with that. I mean, there's plenty of YouTubers have, that have been doing it for quite some time, longer than I have, and they have, you know, taken their journey, and this journey is my journey, and it doesn't really matter what other people are doing or how it's worked out for everyone, but I'm just like, damn. <sighs> Not think it was gonna play out like this. Also, this thing kind of squeaks sometimes, and it's kind of annoying. I am about to run to the yoga studio. I'm teaching a class today. And then I'm going to be going to Ikea to finally get some stuff, just like some finishing touches I need in order to complete my apartment series, which is coming soon. I've been teasing this literally probably since like 2022. It's now 2023. At the studio, I am taking a Pilates class, so let's go. <laughs> I won't force you. I feel like I never shower at the studio, but we have to go to Ikea, so I have to tell you guys a story. So literally this morning, I ended up just going to my core power studio in Brooklyn because I got to the train and I realized that there was no, no way in hell I was gonna make it to Pilates. So I took a class at core power, then I taught two classes at core power, and now it's Ikea time. Oh yeah, that's I'll get more. 
Then I got just some microfiber towels. My cabinets are like kind of weird and they only clean with microfiber towels. If I try to use other towels, it just doesn't work. So I saw these and I just grabbed them for my kitchen cabinets. Okay, and then next, I got this little squeegee for my shower. They had one that was like really nice and like $15 and I thought about getting it, but I was like, I don't use a squeegee yet. So let me just get this cheap one. It was like $2 and then I'll see if I like it. If I like it, then I'll invest and get a nice one. If I don't, then I spent $2. But this should be nice because my shower is all glass. I'm sure you've seen it. And so it gets water spots easily. So I'm hoping I can just use this after my cat is distracting me guys. Then I just got some little plastic baggies because I ran out and I told myself I was going to get like reusable plastic ones, but I haven't done that yet. So <laughs> I saw them and I was like, let me just get them because you know they'd be having the best prices at Ikea. So I just went ahead and grabbed these. Then these are just like these little tiny hooks that I'm going to use for my keys next to my door. I'm really excited. They're just literally three black hooks. I'm like, perfect, needed that. And then I got like a little thing to screw things into the wall. I am not a like Bob the Builder girly, so it should be really fun and interesting to see the adventure on my apartment series. And then I just got like this little nail kit as well because obviously you kind of need this. All right, and then last but not least, my absolute favorite thing. I got these candles from Ikea and they smell so good and they literally, I wanna say they were like $3. Like, they say they're 20 hours of burn time. I don't believe it. But for the price, I'm like, oh, this is a seal. So I just grabbed those. And that is everything. Say hi, Jacques. Say hello. party pooper. All right, well, thank you guys so much for spending the day with me. Again, my name is Nika. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!